Well, this is it. Last moments. Finished in the room. We're all done and we've got to check out. So let's follow Mr. Francis to the folder. Good, good. You've got everything. Just look at these rucksacks and don't laugh. It's as big as me, this one. <laughs> Once more it's not fun. into the breach. Well, there you go. There's the skyline of Hong Kong. It's probably the last time that we're going to see it. We're only hanging about now. We're going to go for something to eat and then we've just got to go and pick up us for about three. We just filled in the questionnaire. Some kids asked us about touri uh, tourism in Hong Kong. Yeah. <laughs> it's hard to be honest with them, but it's not one of our favourite places. It's great. It's a great city, but the people are just bring it down really bad. Really bad. It's a shame really because it's got a lot to offer. I mean I wouldn't say not to come here but I would say to ex expect no help. <laughs> but you know it's 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 a it's a great little city I suppose. It's it just the people. Offer, yeah, the people are very arrogant and rude. Mm -hmm. And we thought Paris was pretty rude didn't we? And if you like shopping it's the ultimate. It's better than New York and London. So take advantage while the tax breaks are on now. You don't pay no tax in Hong Kong. That'll probably change it. So that's about it really, there's nothing much more to say. We'll uh, get something to eat now and then we'll wait for the bus. So that's it really from Hong Kong. Goodbye from Hong Kong. So goodbye from Hong Kong. Well, that's it from Hong Kong. We're going to pick up our bags now in the foyer. And as we walk in, pay, pay attention to the huge Bean Powell pick portrait, which is what the hotel's named after, Bean Peak. And after picking up our rucksacks once more, we found ourselves back on the streets, homeless. Well that's it, we checked out, we got no home again. So we're heading for the bus station. Everybody's looking at us because we've got these big bags on. They got attacked by a board. So off we go. Another encounter on the road. Okay, our timing was absolutely perfect then. We came around the corner, we had the bus just turn up, the A21, just like that. So it was a bit tight. It said 3 o'clock, it's not even 3 o'clock yet. So, better late than never. What do you think, Freddy? Uh, yeah. Tight as usual. Tight as usual. Anyway, that's it. We're on our way to the airport. Oof, bags are coming or something. Yeah, wrong. We're at Hong Kong airport. And as Barry so rightly mentioned, this is a man-made airport and we're all floating on water. So let's get off before it sinks. Well, our flight's on the board, so we're okay. So we're going to have to put these cages on that Barry loves to put on now. Look at that face, loving it. Loving that cage to go on. So anyway, anyway cage time. Checking in again. We've got another one of these health things in case you've got SARS. You know, you're not going to miss it, do you know what I mean? And it's like, oh, it's just going to be nurse, man. Are you going to make? You've got some form of cancer. Look at our Chinese visa. Look, 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 look. Do you remember that? Do you remember? 
Let's see if it works. She knew we were happy with her. And that's when she wants to fill it in. She does do it And now Barney's going to put her in the bin. Yeah, I'm going to tell her. I'm going to say she was practical. Oh, Joel's happy, Barry. Oh, I, I don't know how to do this. Now we've got to do uh, a little bit of lying and say that we haven't got any diseases or crabs, herpes, gonorrhea, AIDS or cancer. We've got mosquito bites. Well, that was it. We've just had our last meal, which is a Burger King. How very Asian. Um, we're just hanging around now till 10 to 6 for our flights, but our 4. We're all booked in, everything's dealt with. We're more hungry than we thought, weren't we? Barry's just doing a form now on ID the girl has served us. So let's take a look at some of the notes he's uh, put down, eh? Well, we're going on Cafe Pacific and our checking girl, ID, ID Y, has given us to ask for a form, see what she's like. So we put, ID was very nice and dead sexy, which she was. We couldn't see, but we're sure she had a great pair of legs. But Ivy was very helpful and friendly. My friend Rob wants to give her one. There you go. So you've got to hand that in now. And hopefully things will improve with Cathy Pacific. Probably the nicest Chinese woman we've met on this trip. Wasn't she right? She certainly was. Yeah, what do we have to do now? We have to stick it all down. We then headed down into the abyss of the departure area. Once more, we were airborne again, with a new destination awaiting us. We left Hong Kong in a northeast direction, travelling 1,344 miles to our next location, Beijing. The flight would take us just over three and a half hours.